hi everyone in the previous video we have learned that how to install code blocks and how to configure gcc with it and in this video is all about our first program in c for a f this is the code block screen for a first program in c we need to make a file in code blocks with a dot c extension uh, so we need to click on this file new empty file so this is you can see that file name untitled 4 but this is more of a text file first we need to save it so we'll click file save file as uh, you should make sure that when we are doing some programming in c when we are saving some c files so save as type should be this c c++ file so now we'll go here and uh, change i'll change the file name i'll make as uh, first program first program dot c so the file which uh, in which we writing c program must be have extension of dot c so i'll save it you can see that now i'm writing our code so this is hash include stdio dot h for before going further in this program you need to understand the meaning of this line hash means pre process include means to include this line this stdio dot h stdio means standard input output so this is the standard library in c which we will use in uh, every uh, our c program to this is the basic standard library for c dot h represent that it is a header file now what is a header file a header file contains some predefined functions which we will be using uh, in our program so to use that functions we need to include this file so this means that pre process this file before uh, going any further in this program so now this in main main is a function in which whatever we want to write our pro uh, want our program to perform we'll write in the body of the main so we'll start the body of the main by this curly braces this is the start of the body or definition of the main and this is the end of the body or definition of the main so this is the starting brace this is ending brace now whatever we want to perform uh, by our program i'll write in this main function so i want to print my program uh, that hello world so i'll use a printf function and i'll write in this like this so printf is a function which is used to print something on screen so whatever it are inside printf inside this double quotes will be printed on the screen so this is the build button in code blocks the compile button basically we need to compile our code before running it so we'll compile it you can see that is saying that process terminated with status 0 0 errors and 0 warning so there is no error in this code so we have compiled it then we need to run it you can see that hello world is printed here so whatever will be written inside this double quote will be printed on the screen i'll change this once we change uh, anything in the code we need to recompile it and then again we am running it it's high there so this is how we can print anything on the screen any 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 thing we want to print so in the next video we learn about data types thank you